Hello everyone. Well, it's a new game we've got here, NIMBY Rails. Now this is a early access one on Steam and uh, yeah, it's just released uh, as of when I'm uh, recording this, which is going to be about a week before you see it. Uh, and that's, uh, yeah, that's just uh, because of the scheduling and everything, right? Anyway, uh, the idea here is I've just opened it up. I haven't done any gameplay other than scrolling around the map a bit. Uh, but other than that, I haven't actually done anything. I've watched a couple of uh, YouTubers uh, do a little bit of tinkering around, so I have a little bit of an idea what I'm doing. But I haven't got everything sussed out, exactly how things are, are going to work out just yet. And that's fine. Uh, the the whole uh, setup here. Hey, let's just uh, dive in and see how the game goes. Uh, anyway, uh, we're going to do a single player game, so we're going to do a new game. And um, what's this do? <laughs> well. We're going to just call this Lost Transport because I think that's funny, right? Uh, we're not going to go unlimited money. We're not going to do any mods and we're going to start the game. And we're going to pause time. Right. Okay. So, yes, that's all there is to starting the game. And this is the map. You're playing it on the actual world map, or at least a version of it. So, yeah, that's uh, that's where we're at, right? Uh, so, hmm. Now, uh, we, we start with a, uh, a billion dollars uh, loan. Uh, so, if we, if we go in here, we have a loan. Uh, which, uh, yep, we're, we're, uh, doing it, uh, we're paying back 18, uh, 18 million dollars per month, apparently, uh, with 60 payments, okay, yep. Um, now, we can take out a new loan, but look at the uh, APR on that. Uh, so yeah, uh, yeah, we're, we're uh, probably not gonna, you see, okay, well, if we go for five years on that, yeah, we get a 7% rate, uh, so, but we could, we could take out, we could take out another billion, uh, how high can we go? nine zero zero yeah uh so we could take out more of a loan at some point uh and then here's our um our accounting here okay so um right okay oh wait i can turn that off so uh, we've also got a population overlay so if we zoom in here uh, we get this uh, shading here uh, for uh, uh, you know population density right so that's useful for deciding what we're going to do uh, and if we go back to the plane map right uh, okay now uh, what I what I'm uh, planning to do here, I'm planning to make one whacking great uh, uh, series here, where I just mess about with the uh, the same map as long as I don't go bust, right? Uh, so I'll just keep coming back to the same map. And what I want to do is ultimately, uh, I want to, yeah, and this is going to take you know, freaking forever. I want to get uh, pretty about as dense of a uh, world transportation network as I can into here. Uh, well, that's interesting. Apparently, we have less detail about the terrain when we get up into uh, Russia. Uh, okay. 
or into uh, Canada for that matter. Yeah, interesting. Northern Canada. Well, that's, that sort of kind of makes sense anyway. That's probably just a map rendering thing. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to actually start out, where is it? Uh, not over here. I'm going to start out in Calgary. Why? Because that's where I'm, I'm living, right? So uh, Calgary seems like a reasonable place to start out, right? Uh, I'm not going to tell you where my house is. Uh, anyway, uh, so I'm going to start out. I'm going to do some, uh, well, what do we have here? Uh, we, we can build tracks, right? Um, so we've got, uh, oh, and that's a great thing about this. Uh, when you're building, uh, it doesn't build it immediately. Um... So we're going to start with making some stations. Uh, and we're going to make tram... Uh, we're going to make tram stations, I think. Now, okay, well, let's turn on the population overlay, right? So this is the population density as the game sees it, right? So... Uh, for those not familiar with, uh, with the city, uh, you know, the, the downtown here, we've got the, that stuff here, and then we've got major roads, which have density around them and areas and so on. But anyway, the idea, I think I'm going to start by putting some, uh, tram stuff, uh, in the downtown area here. Um, now, uh, in, in the actual city, there's a, uh, uh, a light rate lot or light rate, light rail line along this road. Um, so, uh, I think that's actually reasonably well placed to run it through there. Uh, but we have, okay, let's, uh, we need to put uh, some stations in here. Um, yeah, we need to. Um, how are we going to do that? Well, uh, where, um, right, okay, so let's put a, how long is this? Uh, if we make the stations 100 meters, uh, that seems like it might be, uh, that might actually work. There's a, actually is a station there in, in the, uh, in, in Calgary um, and then uh, what's the there's the catchment okay um, we don't need to actually put the stations in where they actually are but I'm going to put because if I put them where they actually are we'd have one here and like one here and one here and <laughs> Uh, yeah, it'd be quite dense, right? Um, well, even so, um, now I'll put one over here. Uh, okay, so we'll do this uh, here. Yeah, we'll put one there. So now if we look, the, it, it splits the catchment areas, right? When you've got stations that are close together. Now that's kind of what I want. Um, now, uh, I don't think... I, no, I don't want to go that way. 
think I want to come over the river. Uh, and actually, over here, um, yeah, over there actually isn't a bad spot. So there is one actually right around here. Um, now the stations have to be straight. Um, no. Uh, let's build it here. Uh, I think 100 meter platforms are probably fine. Uh, so we build, put that there. And I think we'll put one over here as well. Yeah, because uh, the zoo is over here. There's actually one over here in uh, in real life too. Um, and there we go. I'm not putting these uh, at the uh, real life locations just because that's where they are. Uh, it actually makes sense to have them in these uh, locations. Uh, now, um, we need another one somewhere around over here. Um, right. Uh, could put one over here. No, I think over here. Okay, uh, and then, nope, uh, yeah, put one over here. Yeah, so I'll uh, end up renaming those at some point, but yeah, it's, uh, it's fine. Uh, and I think we need one uh, right about here, I think. I'm going to see how profitable this ends up being, right? Um, yeah, okay. So if we come in here and we put it here, Um, there we go. We have one there. Okay, so what we want to do is, now how do we, how do we actually put tracks down? Append tracks or create new ones. Okay, so we're going to want to connect these. like that. Did that actually connect? No. Um, undo. No. Uh, right. Get, grab this. No. Uh, is there an undo? No. Um, okay. Back that up. Okay, and that is 99 meters. Yeah. And okay. Now. Does that? No. How do you? Uh, okay. So if we do that. No. You know, I'm doing a, a dumb here. I need to do this. Yeah. Okay. Now we can do this and move this so it's straight-ish. Yeah. Okay. So we've connected a line there. And then we can connect another one 
there. And one coming out of here. Yep. Okay. And we got another one coming out this way. Uh, okay. Coming up to there. And we connect from there. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to, okay, we got one. Okay, this is where it's going to get interesting because we need to get around. We need to get over the water, right? Um, and that's going to be a little bit of a challenge. I'm pretty sure we're going to need to viaduct to get over here. So uh, let's viaduct from here. Uh to there then um no no uh right um grab this guy grab this guy aha okay Grab this guy up this way. And then we can come around here. And then we can come around this way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Then we can go in here and we can... Uh, we can do this. And we can do that. Aha! Okay. Okay, we can do that. Now, uh, we can come in this way. Um, no. Uh, we're going to go... Uh, back this way. Okay. And we can come in this way. And then... No, we can come out this way. And then we can... Yeah, okay. So that gets that station connected. And we have one more to connect, right? Now, in future episodes, I'm almost certainly going to uh, I'm almost certainly going to run this stuff uh, a little bit uh, more off camera. Uh, the reason being that it takes, as you can see, you can spend as much time as you want uh, putting these these tracks in, right? Uh, okay, we come in this way. Yeah. Okay. And we come out this way. Yeah, okay. So that gets us uh, some uh, rail connections there. Now we need to also uh, come down this way. Right. Come up this way. Uh, now we come up to here. Then we can come out to here, here, and then here. And we can connect that. Okay. Yeah, so that gives us a, uh, a track. That roughly parallels one of the lines in Calgary. Uh, and that's, uh, so, so we have that, right? Uh, so this is going to cost us $12 million to $12.5 to build, right? 
So if we build it, bam, yep. Now what we want to do is make a line, um, create a new line. This is going to be uh, Calgary uh well what are we going to call this we could call it the uh blue line or the red line or the orange line or something uh we're going to call that calgary downtown no uh Yeah, we'll call it downtown for now. Uh, we're going to give it a... Uh, what are we going to do? Uh, we're we're going to give it... Let's give it a... Uh, let's give it a small price, base price. And we'll give it... Uh, say 10 cents per kilometer and see how that does. Now, what color? Let's go for blue. Let's go for a rather startling blue. Okay. I, what, I, I assume that's blue. Okay. Now, um, add stops to line. Uh, okay, so we go from here to here to here to here. We come up around here to there. And then we're going to go back. and back and back 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 and that's that's it okay right okay so that's a line okay now, okay, state, no, stops, estimate travel times, ideal speed, uh, Speed overlay, 45. So we're going to call that 40. Estimate travel times. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Now, uh, we need to add a train. Now, what do we have here? We have a city tram, which... We have this, which can do 70. Uh, this will uh, running cost five per five cents per kilometer. Um, 305 passengers. It can do 70. Uh, right. It's uh, 45 meters, huh? Um, right. Okay. We can actually change the length of it. Okay, yeah, well, we'll do that because I think that's probably about what we need. Pick a decal. Yeah, I guess we'll, we'll pick that. 
Use line color, base color. Um, and I guess we can stick it up here. Yeah, so if we go down there and you can go up here. Yeah, okay. So we'll do that. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. I see. Okay, so we're going to buy... What are we going to do? We're going to put three of... Four of them on there, I think. Three of them, for, four of them. We're going to put four of them. Right. No. We're going to put two of them. And we can add more later. Okay. So now we can buy them. Purchase. Okay. Now we need to... Um, you need to go on a... Um, uh, um, how do we uh, put it on a line? Okay, we clicked on there. Line. Um, okay. Line. Downtown. Yeah, we can start from there. Right. Okay. Um, okay. Run a line, right? Okay. And we're going to do that. And we're going to write. Uh, what's this? What's this? What's this? Um, okay. Now, how do we... Um, okay, here, here, okay. What did I do? Okay. I did something dumb. Uh, where's Calgary? There it is. Okay. There we go. There's our there's our line. Um, now if we do this, okay, we've got a we got a train driving. Yay! Okay, where's the other one? Okay, we're going to have passengers on board. Yay. Okay, so lines. Um, right. 
Okay. Five dollars. Yay. And then there's the other train. Which comes in. Right. I'm going to have to up the fares, obviously. But, uh... Okay. Uh... Okay. Right. Yeah, I'm going to need more trains here. Okay. Trains. Clone. I'm going to put several more on there. Purchase. Yes. Okay. Uh, right, let's uh, up tempo a bit here. Um, yeah, we're going to need to up the, the wait time, I think. Might need to make the trains longer even. Um, right. So we've got, uh, we've got passage. I'm going to need more trains. Yeah, I think, think that's going to be it. I'm going to need more trains. Okay, we're going back. Okay. Right. Okay, we're definitely picking uh, passengers up. And moving them around. So that's that. Good. I do need to space these guys out. But we are... We are definitely running a line. Okay. Uh, we're going to go in here. I'm going to change this to one and one and see what happens. No, I'm going to change this to zero and one. See what happens uh, on that. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, that's going to change. So let's look at accounting here. Running costs, minus 200 maintenance. Okay. So fares, 1592 total, were 1300 positive. Okay. Well. Uh, I think what I need to do is, uh, okay, so what's the, uh, how long are we waiting? Uh, uh, about...
Um, okay, so... Uh, how long are we... Okay, so if we put the minimum interval at... Uh, okay, state. Uh, no, this is what we want to look at. So we're waiting 15, we're waiting about 20 minutes around. We've got um, trains, we've got two, four, six trains. Um, yeah, okay. So, whoops. Um, right. Okay, so if we wait, uh, the interval, if we set that to three minutes, at all of these, Um, this, uh, does this actually space these guys out? Okay. Okay, now. I think these guys are spaced out now. Okay, so we get here, and he's going to wait... He's just going to go, right? Then he's going to come up. Right? And he's going to wait for 30 seconds. Okay. Oh yeah, these guys are uh, spacing out now. Okay, good, 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 good. Now what I want to do is I want to look in here and take a look at what our uh, um, ongoing, okay, so fares, uh, total, yeah. Um, day, yeah, day is fine. Um, okay, so uh, we have spent on construction and trains, but we do seem to be, um, we do seem to be at least moving passengers around. Okay. So, uh, that is a line operating. Can't say is that's uh, such a bad thing. Now, what, I, what I'll probably do is, uh, you know, expand this out uh, some more. Uh, see if we can get some good networking effects going on in the, uh, in the whole thing here. Uh, is the more we more we have connected we have things connected the better the overall uh, performance of the of the line will be right now in the actual uh, city uh, this line would continue out through here uh, it would run I think it runs along over here and then comes up along here before coming down this way and then over around, you know, somewhere like uh, way out here. Uh, 
I can't remember exactly. I'm obviously not going to duplicate that. It's just that this particular line does make some sense. There's another line that goes south, and we'll probably end up doing that as well. Right. Um, yeah, there's passengers arriving. So yeah, this is definitely uh, operational. So um, we're going to obviously need to have enough cash coming in to pay our loan at some point. But note that there's no... Um, didn't reach a destination or complained about fares or whatever here. Uh, so I'm going to go back in here. Uh, I'm going to put a one here and see if people start complaining. Uh, I'm raising the fares just to see. Uh, because if we, uh, if we can soak people for a little bit more money, uh, we can end up with uh, with a little bit more uh, income, right? I'm not sure what the sweet spot is. Um, right. Uh, so far, we don't seem to have complaints. Uh, we're probably going to have people that waited too long. Well, let's look at accounting here. Uh, so we're we're coming out twenty grand up so far, and we're only part way through the uh, day. Now, if we up tempo on this, uh, we can see things going way faster, right? Uh, and that uh, uh, so if if we can uh, have uh, you know a hundred k a day or something coming in off of one line. Uh, we, we'd be doing, we'll be laughing. Now, obviously, that's not enough to pay for the loan, but that's fine. Uh, we don't, we don't have to pay for that just yet. Okay, one and two does seem to be uh, operational for, uh, for the uh, affairs. So, right, so that's, uh, yeah, it looks like we're going to have uh, a quite a substantial uh, uh, total uh, total net positive here. Um, yeah. So my my goal here is to get uh, a fairly substantial and dense network running in Calgary, and then. I'll look at expanding out to neighboring towns step by step. Uh, I'm ultimately going to set up uh, an intercity uh, line that will run up up through. Well, we can back out here. Uh, we can turn this back to plane. Uh, ultimately, what I'm going to do is run an intercity line that's going to go from Calgary somewhere up through Airdrie, uh, maybe these guys, uh, but it's definitely going to stop in Red Deer. Uh, and it's going to come up, it'll probably stop around Leduc and somewhere in Edmonton, right? Uh, that's, you know, is, uh, that is, uh, that's the, the plan, right? Uh, I'm not sure, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get there, how quickly, but uh, that is uh, the idea. Right. Okay. Uh, let's, uh, let's zoom back in here. Uh, this is uh, going to be all I'm doing for this, uh, this episode here. But uh, as we can see... Uh, the total uh, cash. Um, we got people that are unhappy. Uh, okay. 
right uh stops no we're going to drop this back to one and slow this back down yeah okay so that is probably uh yeah now if we click on here we have mediocre okay uh right okay right and of course the passenger counts vary based on time so that's definitely going to uh, impact things as well uh right uh, okay so if we look under accounting yeah uh, okay accounting um Oh, right. This is based on UTC. Right. Uh, okay. So we're up to 180 K total. Um, yeah. Uh, okay. So that's, um, that's not too bad. Anyway, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm going to end the episode here and, uh, uh, next time, uh, I'll be back with uh, probably uh, building another line uh, and uh, connecting it through here. And uh, we'll see what, uh, what happens. Yeah, that's, that's probably what I'll do. Right. Good. Uh, anyway... Uh, so I guess that's going to be all for now. So stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. I mean, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. And I guess see you back next time.